thereabouts ahead once we satisfy the requirements for Pritchard's task, it won't be able to... We won't be able to get everything that we can on that mission if we don't have some clear space. So this is a good practice to do in between missions, in between important events, and mainly it's the main missions that send you to other lands of which you cannot retain these weapons. So if you drop them there, you cannot go back. Uh, then stop off at your home, and also while you're here, maybe give it a save. Because that seems like the right thing to do. Also, I don't want my progress to be lost when we've come so far. Anything can happen at this point. Do I plan on doing a Kingdom Hearts Let's Play? Good question. You know, I haven't really uh, gotten into that series as much as I would have liked to. Just a matter of, of time. And I don't have enough to invest into another RPG. But I did play Chain of Memories on the GBA, and that was fun. I couldn't beat it, though, because at some point I was level ground to the point where I couldn't alternate the stats. You know... You get to a point in some RPGs when they're not well balanced in experience that you can gain and how you can rearrange your abilities. You get to a point in some RPGs where you realize the stats you've been working on so hard aren't actually going to help you do what you want. And that was the case in Kingdom Hearts Chain of Memories. I couldn't get enough power to defeat one of the bosses, and so I was perpetually stuck there. A big problem. Big problem. So I put it down after that, but, you know, maybe I would do uh, Kingdom Hearts. If there was a Kingdom Hearts for me to play, which would you recommend? How about that? I'll pose a question to the audience to see which one you'd really like to see played through more. Uh, Retrieve O'Malley's package. I thought we did that. What the? Wait a sec. Wait a sec. Laying around and debris in the maintenance corridor in front of the Kieran building. I've got to get it and bring it back to Jenny. Alright, hold on a sec. Didn't we just gain that package? Wasn't that the whole point of dodging all that fire? I thought we gained it. Well, you know what? I don't care. Even if we didn't, we'll be heading back to the DRB territory later on. So, it's not such a big deal. I want to go to his apartment first and see what we can Ugh. dig up. And if we need to do any hacking of the sorts by that AUD device, whatever that thing's called. The ultimate hacking device that will break through any security system. And then I want to use it now. Alright, his apartment should be around here. I'm trying to remember, was it guarded by a gate? This city is one big gutter and always will be. Yep, it is. is <laughs> guarded by this thing. Do we have the lock? Or do we have the code for the lock? Nope. How about a hack? Oh, two. Gotta be kidding me. Alright, well, there are only yeah, right. dumpsters around here. I guess they're talking about augmenting dogs. Let's see, we need some sort of box. That's the problem with not having the highest uh, strength possible. You can't pick up any item you wish and use it to your advantage. Now, what does this do? How could it be beneficial to... Oh, shit! I have never even found this before. No way. No fucking way. That's awesome, dude. Hey, thanks for leaving me some weapons up there. Greatly appreciate it. I'm curious, what did that pocket secretary have to say? Who leaves someone a sniper rifle in that area and doesn't have a, a plan to kill someone? TV crews on their way... Before taking a shot, aim for the area between the cops and protesters. That way, both of them think other side fired first. There might be a riot. Oh, wow. That's crazy. Somebody trying to provoke riots between protesters and cops. Hmm. That sucks. So, where's a box? Where is there a box? Can we even... Is there any way? 
Is there any other way to get in there besides wasting another one of these AUDs? I don't want to do that. I really don't. Oh, wait. This way. What if we went in here? Whose apartment is this? Well, what we, I'm thinking we might be able to do is possibly find a window to jump out of and jump over that fence. Because I can't move the cans right now. I can't move the uh, garbage bins. But we got to get over there. At least I believe we have to get over there. Good, this only has a rating of one. So this will easily be hacked. And remember, hacking upgrades our experience. So it's important to do. Even if you don't intend to gain any useful information from it, thinking that it's useless, it's still good experience. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Access yes. granted. Brilliant. Whose apartment is this? This is nobody in importance, right? I don't think this is someone important. No, but they've got a very nice bedroom. Man, this is a very nice room indeed. It looks completely unlived in. Interesting. Uh, yep, so like this. This is a completely waste of time to go in here, really, other than enjoying the aesthetics of the room. There's not a whole lot you can do. So there are some setup buildings that just offer experience points in the form of those locks. There are others that actually grant you some good items. Huh. If I was a box, where would I be? You'd think there'd be plenty of cardboard boxes in the alleyway. But I guess all the homeless people took them. See, here's some cardboard, but you can't jump on it. And I can't take their barrel, because they're using... There's a box. Alright, good. I just need a slight lift, because we've already got the augmentation to jump up higher. Oh, and I think I see another box there, too. Brilliant. Brilliant! But before I even do a box stacking puzzle, let's just try and jump. Aha! So because I have a higher up jump, I can now get up this side ladder, which will take me somewhere. Somewhere to an objective, hopefully. Or it could just be a waste of time for me. Hmm, it's looking like a waste of time. That's unfortunate. Um, hmm. Oh, unless this guy's place is in this building. Is that the is that the case? I'm telling you, whatever they're doing in there, it's gotta be stopped. Thousands of children Sounds like somebody's augmenting themselves in one of the apartments. That's disturbing. Aha! The infamous door we've been looking for. And we don't know the hack. Cool, but that's fine. It's only a security rating of one. This will be easy to get. Or so I thought. I did a space there to do the quick stop. This way we have no worries about entering this system. Granted. And with that extra couple of seconds, we can gain entry to this guy's place. Alright, now we just gotta find some suspicious stuff. Find suspicious evidence. Read the newspaper. Very nice. And what about in here? Well, this is... I think a 4 or a 3. Yep, it's a 4. So of course it's unreasonably high, because this is where the evidence is. Oh no. I don't have any more? Oh, you gotta be fucking kidding me. Alright, so that's the problem. I don't have any more of those odd things. I didn't realize that I didn't have any more. I thought that they were just there, so they were there. Um, what we'll have to do is quickly go back to the weapons dealer. Alright. If I do this, then this. If I do this, then that. Tab... 
tab, shift tab, and I want to find, uh, it doesn't have any instruction manual, of course not, why would it? How can I reject my gun or retain it? Shitskies. Alright, so if anybody is watching this, do a Google search quickly for me on Deus Ex Human Revolution, how to holster your weapon. Because I'm very confused on how to do that, and that guy will not sell us jack shit if we don't put our weapon away. Damn it. Who's alarmed? Let's see. Nope, this is the same security rating from this side, too. Oh, this guy's just sleeping. I was gonna say, what are you doing, homeless guy? Uh huh. Seraph. Oh, what's back here? Wait a sec, can I jump this fence? Nope, I need a jump. I need something to stand on. Can I stand on the homeless guy? No. Alright, so that's how I do it. If I was a method of holstering my weapon... You press H. Okay, now I get it. That's pretty simple, and I'm glad. Glad that it was. Yeah, what are you looking at, Ghoulie? Jeez, I hope he has some more of those odds to hack those systems. Otherwise, I'm not going to be able to get in there at this point. Had a feeling I would use too much in the cop What'll palace. It be? The pig palace. Bye. Nope. No more of those. Figures. Be sure to tell all your friends. Just, just not the not cops. The cops. <laughs> Who's disliking this? Yeah, really. Enjoy. I hope you would enjoy this. I'm playing this for 24 hours for the sake of children and people dislike. Oh, trolls. Never fail to amuse me. So here's what we're going to do. We do not have the capabilities yet of accessing that information in that locked room. Because we need another one of those odd things. So I'm going to run back to DRB territory. Because that's where our next objectives are anyway. And I'm going to see if in the process of scavenging that place, we can find ourselves a hacking device. We can find ourselves a hacking device that allows us entry into that place. Is this where we were going for the secret? Yep, that's right. The secret entry of easy access between lands. The mystical corridor crammed within the buildings. I don't even know why they have this crawl space. I guess to let vents ventilate? Maybe? Who knows? Nope, that's dead end. Need some strength in order to do that. Kingdom Hearts you know, for sure, I'm going to have to go back and read some of these comments of people suggesting what games I should uh, should take a look at. Problem with a game like Kingdom Hearts, I didn't want to... I was just pressing shift to run. You didn't have to pull out your gun. I guess Jensen likes to run and gun. Uh, the problem with the Kingdom Hearts, or any RPG series for that matter, it's just like Final Fantasy. I have such a hesitation to start any of that game up. Not because I thought originally my idea was that I would be lost everywhere I went in the story. I thought it was consecutive. Yeah, really. Um, I don't know. Trolls would dislike things for charity. Um, but Kingdom Hearts, Final Fantasy, games like that are too long. I play Pokemon. That's my RPG. Oh, good. I thought you guys were evil. And to take more time out of playing Pokemon to play another RPG, it, I know it sounds fanboyish, but I just don't have the time or effort for that. 
And it's not so much fanboyism as it is real life getting in the way of gaming. Which is why I love doing things like this, because it's real life being aided by gaming. Because for whatever donation money we make here today, I mean, I set my goal at a reasonable $100. I think we definitely can all generate that by the end of this marathon, so long as you guys keep sharing this stream with all your friends on Facebook and people on Twitter, whoever you have social networking to. I think we definitely can raise $100. But any ounce of money, any drop, any penny really helps people out because there are so many of us out there who cannot afford proper health care. And like I was saying at the beginning of the stream, leaders lead. They're going to do what they do no matter what this cause or what the stake of politics is. And I'm not going to wait around for any sort of Romney care, Obama care, can all, you know, you can kiss my ass. I don't believe in any of them as far as a running president. So I'm just going to do what I do to help people in a real way. Yeah, see, I can't select this package. I definitely have already acquired everything I can from here. At least from that package. But there's still another entry point that we did not get to because we were being blasted at for so long. Oh, fuck. I knew someone was here. No, you didn't. You, can't hit me? you son of a bitch. Goodbye. You wanna hide behind them? Fuck. I'm gonna hold on to my life. Uh, if you want to do Yeah, no, I mean, I would play games for 24 hours, if that's fair enough. I would play games for 24 hours if allowed to, but with charity, it actually does something. It generates some happiness other than me just playing a game, which is fun in itself, but you know, now I get to help people out. Alright, we're going to have to wait for good health. Regen. Yep, I am reading all the comments as they come up on the chat. I've got like two screens right now. One's over there, one's right here that I'm playing on. Come on, health regen faster. There's an augmentation that will upgrade that as well. So if you guys comment and want to join the conversation, then I will be happy to make the purchase. That's why I'm doing this marathon also. I love to game with people. That was always the biggest problem about being a gamer, at least in Jersey. You know, I've only found like three other people that really like games as hardcore as I do, as hardcore as I do. So it's difficult to find somebody to talk about games with when you're in that sort of situation. You're just a bunch of weedos and weedettes here in Jersey. 